What's up guys, in today's video we'll be going over the new Heatwave event. So the first thing you get when you log on is the Heatwave Hero free title. And of course you can enjoy some of this music. So these are the new items, well not every new item, but majority. Cockatiel Moon, Secret Knot, and of course the exclusive Heatwave podium that will not return once Heatwave leaves. So if you want that podium, just make sure to grab it. Of course, we have all the old skins also returning. In my honest opinion, of course, the best Heatwave skins are still the Nyx skin and the All Days Mordex. I'm not the biggest fan of the Heatwave event when it comes to skins, but of course, these two just honestly stand out to the, I would say the majority of the community. So yeah, if you want some Heatwave skins, I recommend those too. The new skins aren't really all that bad, but you know, we all have our favorite Heatwave skins. We also have the KO effect of Hot Lava, and of course, the exclusive podium I was talking about. And we also have a new emote called Beachside Break. Pretty nice emote. It's kind of similar to the Mushroom one if you had that from like season five, but kind of different too. You know, we, we have the titles that, I mean, not the titles, the avatars that come back every single year. Nothing too crazy here. And of course, if you've been playing Heat Wave every single year, we have colors on the new characters that came out recently. Ezio. Red Raptor, Tesca, and the. Now we're just gonna do like a quick little color showcase for both the characters. I don't have all the colors anymore. I didn't even play the colors of their Raven event fully through, so yeah. But I still own a vast majority, so you know, I might as well, you know, I have all the battle passes and the majority of all the event colors, so you can still get a pretty good look at what potentially you can do with these new character and skins in my honest opinion they're not bad i've seen way worse skins honestly would i buy either one of these two probably not the skins are not bad like i said but i don't really see myself ever really using these two honestly i like moon skin from the battle pass and i like queen eye skin from the battle pass and those two honestly i feel like can't be beat but overall, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this event. Until next time, peace.